Hey, it's Friday and it is a fuck it Friday and I'm a little bit later than usual because I was with a client today and I came home and I thought, oh, I'm not going to do it today, it doesn't matter. And then I went and looked at the schedule, the list I have of what I'm going to talk about on different days and today it said, um, fuck it to feeling like I have to say yes and remembering that saying no is saying yes to something else. And I read that and I thought, Wow, I've been talking about this all week with people. It's really important that I do a, a quick live broadcast about this. And, you know, if you're not watching now, that's absolutely fine. You can watch it later. But I just want to say fuck it to feeling like you have to say yes. And remembering a couple of things. One, saying no often is saying yes to something else. And two, when we say yes and we feel like we have to say yes, it means that we are, hello if you're just watching, when we say, when we're saying yes and we mean no, we're actually doing that person a disservice, we're doing ourselves a disservice, we are in a place where there's a level of resentment, there's somewhere, we're not saying yes to ourselves when you feel like you have to say yes. So it's being really clear, who are you saying yes to? And remembering that you don't have to say yes, you always have a choice. And sometimes that choice might be a difficult choice, but you always have a choice. So we need to look at what am I getting? What need is being met by me saying yes here? Is it that someone will like me? But if I say yes, what does that mean for my energy levels, for my reserves, for my respect for myself, for my boundaries, for how well I'm going to be able to deliver? So it's just a really quick note. Um, and and we're, we're all conscious of this, including myself. I often go, oh, I'll just say yes, because um, that person will like me or it will be easier. It's easier than saying no. Or I, I just feel like I really should say yes. And the clues there, if you have to, if you're feeling like you have to say yes, or you're feeling like you should say yes, the likelihood is that you probably don't want to and it's probably a no. And that might be a more difficult thing to say but that's you choosing you it's you choosing to listen to your intuition <laughs> hey Bev yeah well it's a lesson I'm working on it all the time as well you know I'm not perfect at it by any stretch of the imagination I've had to learn how to say yes and how to say no and the, and the deal is this if you want a really big fuck yes you've also got to have a really big and strong fuck no and I, and I mean that, and for such a long time I didn't have a strong no, which meant that I also didn't have a strong yes. So I'm going to leave you with that. You need to practice saying yes when you mean yes, and no when you mean no. Noticing if you should or you feel you have to say yes, and looking at what else you could say, and what you would be saying yes to if you said no. So um, I wish you a really lovely weekend. Thank you for joining me, Bev. Lovely to have someone here. And um, for the rest of you, I hope this has been a useful little piece of insight. And I'll see you on Monday. Bye.